I know the first time we were getting a little scared because we're, we're hearing shots going off, guns going off. And we didn't know really what it was. What they're doing, they're shooting the dogs. The Germans were getting rid of the dogs because you, you're walking along and a German's trying to, with a guard, he's trying to pull his dog along and they were in a blizzard and it was not easy. So, uh, easy, so they had, so that they're doing it, they're shooting the dog, get rid of them, get rid of them. And then, of course, they, don't forget, these guys are marching along with us. Yeah. And they're probably, they're probably worse off physically than, than you are. Mm -hmm. And so, and I'll tell you one thing, by that second night, and I say this many times, there was no prisoners on that road, and there were no German guards on that road. That second night, there was nothing but a group of human beings trying to work their way to get through this whole business. Mm -hmm. There were no guards, that's in there. Nobody tried to escape, as far as I know. You just, just, we're just trying to get to, get to where we had to, wherever that was. We didn't know where we were going at the time. But we just had to try to get there, that's all. And, uh, but no, no guards ever yelled at us. No guards ever tried to shoot us. It was, a, it was nothing like with the Japanese mm -hmm. death marches that they had in Bataan or something like that. No. Uh, we, uh, they're just a bunch of humans being some sense.